just arrived. -da 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 -da. A brand new laptop. So exciting. I have three laptops now and I know I realized that is very excessive. This is the laptop that I was using for so long now. The only problem is if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, then you wouldn't have known that I broke the screen. I put a memory card in between the keyboard and the screen and I closed the laptop and boom, the LCD broke. Now, every time I use it, my eyes hurt so bad because there are like lines everywhere and I can't see. I did get myself another laptop. Hold on, let me show you. It's my work laptop and this is the pretty Asus laptop in Lilac Mist. And I use it every time I need to do work for Slater at Lightblock or if I need to do like government stuff, Excel sheets and stuff like that, then I use the Asus. But every time I need to do anything creative like Photoshop or Lightroom or, you know, anything creative, then I still really prefer a Mac because it's just easier when you're so used to the system and like we are all on iCloud, me, my team, Slater. So all the files are there. So it's just so much easier to have a whole system like in one Mac system ecosystem if that makes sense so anyway we got this new laptop it is a macbook air the new one i think they call it the m1 which means that if i'm not mistaken now i'm not really techie but slater taught me everything about the m1 he's actually the one who decided that i would get this type of laptop so it's the macbook air it's a very beautiful gold color and the m1 means that instead of using an intel processor apple has actually made their own called the m1 so we are gonna unbox it today. This was actually gifted to me by Apple Cart PH. And thank you so much, Apple Cart, because my God, I miss the time when my laptop was a MacBook Air. I think the last time I had a MacBook Air I was still in college. Um, I've been using MacBook Pro since then, and the Air is just so much prettier. I'm so excited to open this and show you guys. Okay. Let me transfer here. Also, I just got out of the shower. My hair is still wet, so sorry. I'm just so excited to open this up for you guys. I'm gonna sit here so you guys can see. And I have my scissors with me. And my gosh, unboxing, oops. Unboxing a laptop, oops. Uh, oops. I don't know why the scissor keeps going to the side, but it's very, very exciting. Every time like I unbox a new Apple product, I'm excited. Who is the same as me? Like, I don't usually do unboxings on my channel, but it's rare that I have a lap, like a new laptop to show you guys. It's so exciting. I feel like it's Christmas day already. And plastic. I feel like Apple products are so well packaged. Like everything's minimal, functional. Like, sakto lang talaga yung box niya. No nonsense. So, ooh, MacBook Air, 8 gigabyte memory, 512 gigabyte SSD, 13 inches. Moment of truth, guys. I don't have a fancy setup like Slater with all of his like arms. He can get top view and side view and stuff like that. So I hope this is okay. I'm just gonna do it my way. I'm so excited. Guys, the color is so pretty. Is it rose gold or gold? Is it rose gold? It just says gold. Does it even say gold? But it looks rose gold. Whoa, whoa. It says rose gold. I mean, it looks rose gold. It actually, it looks like it matches the pink on my wall. How pretty is that, guys? Oh my goodness. Ah, satisfaction. I know a lot of beauty and fashion channels will do Hermes unboxing, Chanel unboxing. And I love, don't get me wrong, I love a good bag unboxing too, but this, because I'm gonna use it every single day, I know this is really, uh, I love it so much. It's gonna mean a lot to me, this unboxing. So, this is how thin it is, guys. Ta-da! Ta-da! See, it really does match my wall. How cute is that? It's not gold, it's rose gold. It's kind of like pinkish gold even. Oh my god, I love the color so much. Slater actually also has one. I think he got his in space gray, which is the color of my old um, laptop. So yeah, the charger's here, complete. And this plug here. And then we have like the service card. 
says Apple Malaysia. And then this says designed by Apple in California and all the like pamphlet stuff that I don't really need to check out anymore. Let's open this baby up, shall we? All right, whoa. <gasps> it turns on right away. Oh, it's so pristine. Slater is actually out. Um, he's in a meeting right now. And so I'm like, yes, I have all the time in the world to play with the laptop without him needing me. Not that <laughs> I don't like it when he needs me. It's just like, I have all the time in the world to like play around with it all by myself without, you know, Scott still sleeping. Is the main language. Press the return key. It's talking. Guys, this is so fun. I'm going to do this for the rest of the day and I will catch you um, li a little bit later. But guys, this girl is so happy. Thank you so much, Apple Card PH. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. So guys, it's been a minute. It's been a few days. I just woke up. Look at my face. I'm still so ngarag. I just woke up, rushed to the kitchen, cooked food for Slater, fed Scotty, prepared everything. And um, now I'm going to show you what I did because today is Slater's birthday and we're going to surprise him. He's actually awake already. He doesn't know what's about to happen today. He doesn't know that his team from Lightblock is going to surprise him in, in, in about an hour. But before that, we are going to go outside and have breakfast. And I prepared a little something from him for him. It's very, very simple lang because I don't have time and I don't have um, the energy. But I hope it's, I think he's going to love it anyway. I want to show you. I've said it many times, I know. I would change my ways, I know for sure. When all the crows decide to meet. They settle down beneath my feet I've got it right and I got it wrong But I learned my lesson hanging on Alright, everything's prepared, music on, Scotty's in the pen It's a rainy day outside And we're gonna go get Slater now Hello birthday boy can I go out now? Yes. Wow, a nice morning massage you have there. Uh, I'm sleepy, man. I'm sleep locked up. No. Come out. Come out, come out, come out. Mm. Come out, Ramred. How? <laughs> Wow, you're using the big cam. Yeah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Come sit here with me by the fire and let it go for a little while. So be. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Only one rice for you, Scott. Only this is your food. Scott. Yeah, Tiana for rice. Hachi, bless you. Hi, bless you. Time to eat, Rama. Here comes the sun. It's all
Mummy! Alright guys, I am freshly showered and I'm sorry it's a bit noisy. I'm keeping the vacuum running so Slater can't hear me. Um, we're actually gonna surprise him now. A few of his office staff from Lightlock are gonna come here. They've dressed up the car and they're gonna surprise him. So I'm gonna tell Slater that there's a Lazada delivery outside and um, I want him to check if it's his order or not, something like that. And then they're gonna be outside to surprise him. Wish us luck! Guys, they're so cute. Oh my god, there are three cars. Do you see that? Let me try to zoom in for you guys. I really hope Slater's is still inside his office. While they are setting up, I think I'm gonna change my game plan. I think I'm gonna tell Slater, Hobbs, can you take my photo outside? Like, really quick lang. And then, he won't know that they're outside and I'm so excited his team is so cute they love him so much he really prepared all of this for him and because it's like quarantine season they are just going to surprise him they put all the balloons inside the car so they don't have to come in the house they don't have to like disturb anything um, I think it's so sweet they're backing up I think the surprise is in that car over there Oh, so cute! Who's that? I heard a oh, wow. Who is that? Is that Slater? Oh no! Oh no, it's Slater. Did you see it? Summer? Can you help me shooting? Okay, he didn't know after all. It's still a success after all. Okay. Ah! Here, come. Help me shooting. Here, here, here. What do you want me to do? Wait, 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 wait. Outside, I need my slippers. Here, right this. What's up? Oh. <laughs> 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 Happy birthday to you! <laughs> Happy birthday to you! Thank you! <laughs> <sighs> Guys, it's been a minute. It's actually already two days after I last vlogged. And the last time that I vlogged was Slater's birthday in the morning. And so much has happened since then. I'm so sorry. It's just things keep getting in the way when I try to vlog. Like there's a blackout or Scotty needs me or I need to do so many other things. My gosh, as I mentioned before, it's really so hard to vlog if you're a mom because everybody needs a mom. <sighs> And so today, finally, finally, I put on some makeup, I did my hair, I woke up so early, I didn't get to sleep last night, and I said, yes, okay, today I'm going to vlog. And I told Slater not yesterday, can you remind me to vlog? Because I keep forgetting, like, the camera's just on the kitchen counter, and because I'm so busy, it's always my last priority. Sorry, you know, you guys know I love you. But yeah, today, so I finally got ready, I did my hair, everything, and then, like, right after I put on my lipstick, like, pagkatapos na ng lahat, brown out, guys. It's like the world, not the world, but like the energy right now. Ayo nilang ko kayo. I don't know, it's so weird. But anyway, it's still, what time is it? 
9 a.m. Scotty's already napping, but I wanted to close this vlog because it's been so random. Also, Scotty has started eating his solids, and it's so weird because the first time that I documented it for you, um, we only gave him like maybe one to two tablespoons worth of sweet potato, which is what we gave him. But now, guys, he can finish a whole bowl by himself and he eats twice a day and you guys were right his poops are so weird now the color is dependent on the food that he's eating like if he's eating carrots then his poop will be orange if he's eating cauliflower then his poop will be a cauliflower color it's so weird another update he hates water and he needs water to make his poop like softer because now when he poops like before he just pooped like it's nothing right like it's nobody's business because he was just on breast milk but now that he's eating solids his poop is becoming more solid also and every time he poops he's like like that he becomes so red it's so funny and so we are trying our best to get him to drink more water so that um, his poop will come down faster but he hates it we are trying to um, put the water in a cup or in a sippy cup or in a bottle Wala, ayaw na talaga. we also tried putting water in a spoon and just feeding it to him but he does not want to take it. Something that he loves, banana. I tried to give him a banana baby led weaning style and he absolutely loved it. Like, it was so funny. With regards to Scott's sleep, he has been sleeping sort of straight through the night. He'll go down at like 6.30 and he'll wake up at about 3 a.m. I will feed him once and then his next wake up is gonna be at 6.30 if we're lucky, but if we're unlucky, then sometimes it's 5 or today it was 4.30, he was up already. Oh my god, but at least once in the middle of the night, na siya nagigising to eat. So I'm so happy. Hopefully, in the future, like he can sleep through the night, but talaga his sleep will be undisturbed. He has also transitioned already from three naps to two naps, so just about the right time because he's already six months old. He takes about an hour and a half to two hour long naps, two hours if we're really, really, really lucky. He's becoming so much easier to take care of. I was just telling my midwife earlier, like, crab, I remember the times when both of us would have no sleep because we would like be constantly one of us has to always be with Scott and while one of us is with Scott the other one's like washing dishes or changing diapers or facing his room or like all of these little things but now um, because he's so chill like literally I can leave him in his playpen and then like make breakfast or like my midwife can take him out for a walk outside our house while I prepare breakfast for Slater and I or while Slater and I are chilling we can actually do other things now like I can sit down with you right now and not have to worry about Scott waking up any minute because he's napping and I'm sure like when he's awake he's not gonna be fussy like it's just so much easier so if you're a new mom watching this don't worry you will get there and things will get easier I swear I swear Scott cannot crawl yet but I think he's getting there. He's slowly lifting himself up so he can go on his all fours now. But he'll just like plop down. And instead of crawling, he'll just like roll over. I don't know if that's gonna change in the coming months. I know some babies, um, Scott's age, can already crawl. And some babies don't crawl altogether and just start walking right away. So I don't know what Scott will be like. But I'm so excited to find out. I'm also kind of scared because when he crawls, like he's gonna be all over the place. And I'm gonna have to keep chasing him. So <laughs> I'm gonna get even busier. But yeah, it's gonna be another milestone. And I'm so lucky because now that we're all at home I'm here for every single one of his milestones and that's really such an amazing blessing all right guys I have been talking for so long now um, I'm gonna call it a video I know this is kind of a jumble video but this is going to cap the year and I want to thank you guys so much for being part of the sky fam this year we grew so much and you know what I just read a message earlier from one of my followers that watching SkyFam vlogs are really like her safe space and she feels so at home when she's watching videos of ours and I just want to say that I feel the same way like every time I'm talking to you guys like right now with the camera I feel like I'm just talking to a friend it's a nice way for me to kind of release or express everything that I've been thinking of for the past few days and it's always nice to know that no matter like where life takes us there's a community behind us that's always you know just as excited as we are to experience all these new milestones in life and I'm honestly, honestly so happy to have everyone here with us today. Thank you, thank you guys so much for making our year such an amazing one. I know 2020 has been crazy, but with the Sky Fam, you know, it, it was a lot better. With that being said, I want to wish you guys a very, very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We love you guys so, so, so much. And I will see you guys in 2021. Bye!